Hi, this is Mike from Motor Stop, and I'm, today I'm going to show you how to install one of our UV air treatment systems. Today we're going to install the OS36, and I'm going to show you quickly how we determine where we're going to put the unit. On a typical installation, what we prefer to do is put it right above the air conditioning coil, which is here, and we put it right into the main trunk line, but because there's a humidifier already installed, we're going to go to our second option, our plan B, which is on the return air vent. Now as you can see, I've already taken out the template which is in the back of the, of the owner's manual and I've taped it on where I want it to be. We've turned off also the power to the unit so it's not going to be running and I'm going to show you how to install it now. So it's very simple, we're going to use a drill with a 3 32nd bit and a two and a half inch hole saw and a three quarter, or excuse me, a quarter inch nut driver. Those are all the only things we need for installation. Now I'm going to go ahead and put on my hearing protection. I already have eye protection on, and I'm also going to put on some gloves because, as it says in the owner's manual, these, this is going to be pretty sharp once we cut it. So it might get a little louder here. I'm also going to put on a timer to show just how easy and, and quick it is to install. So, let's start the timer. And here we go. So first, I'm gonna follow the instructions and pre use my 332nd drill bit to pre-drill these holes. Now we're only gonna drill five holes because we're not installing a 72, which is a two ball, we're only installing a one ball here. Okay, all I'm gonna do now is switch this out and put in the two and a half inch drill bit, hole saw and drill it out of shelf. Now you want to be careful to get this out if you can, the disc out. From there, that's all we're going to need to do on that. Take all this off. We're going to take our four screws, take our unit, pop the light bulb in, and of course take this off. Get a little ahead of myself here. Just discard that for now. We're going to insert this all the way in. And then what I like to do is put all the screws in loosely first. And this kind of makes it easier to get everything centered up. Now just take a look at it once you get all four in, take a look at it, and then you want to snug all the nuts, or snug all the, all the screws, but do not over tighten them. And that's why you want to do it by hand as well. There's a rubber, a pre-applied rubber seal on the back, which forms a real nice tight fit. So now once you get them all snug, double check. They're all set. And then they're just going to plug it in. Turn it 
turn it on. See the light indicates that everything's all set. And that was three and a half minutes. So, uh, super easy to do. Just take some care to make sure you put it in the right position in your furnace. And that's pretty much it. Anything else, uh, please visit our website, odorstop.com. You can also look for other products that we have. Thank you.